as you can see, the rain has really started to come down. I'm walking through Brussels and I said I didn't want to become drenched because I've got a bus journey tonight. So I just need to get back to the place, charge my phone, try and dry up and then yeah but this isn't the greatest timing in the world i'm not gonna lie Today, right after rain now. My mum will be watching this, and she did tell me to bring a coal, but I didn't have the space for it in my bag. It's that one day though, so I'll be alright. I can always change my jumper. <laughs> so it stopped raining, and it's actually quite nice now. It's quite warm. I put my jumper back on and left where I was, and now I'm really hot. I just I do state the obvious a lot, but yeah, pretty much. Um, I'm gonna head down into Brussels, see what I can see. It's just been on and off rain all day, so I don't really know what to expect. But I don't know how long this video is gonna be. I don't know how long I can actually get it, how much content I can get before. Obviously, I have to get on the bus to, Am to Amsterdam. So, I don't know, we'll see. In fact, I might include the bus journey from, Amsterdam, from Belgium to Amsterdam in this video. I might not, I don't know. We'll see what happens. See, you think you've seen the whole of the city and then you just end up going down here, for example. Like, what's down here? I don't know. I've not seen it before, so the only way of finding out is going down. I don't actually speak like this in real life. I, I feel like I speak quite high pitched. And, yes, I'm doing this. I'm doing it. If you meet me in real life, I'm just I'm not like that. And I don't know how I've developed this kind of. I'm not a different personality on camera, but I just speak. I feel like now I'm just speaking completely normally. But on camera, I start doing so. Hey, where, 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 where. Have I been here? Yeah, no, I have been here. Hang on, where am I? I, I yeah, thought this was thought this the about. same road. No, it's not. This is the other road. So I'm going to walk down here. The only thing is, when you've got a backpack on, it's so heavy, it just weighs you down. You end, up speak, you end up walking like this. So it's gone back to raining again. I've got another hoodie on, so the one underneath is drenched, and now this is going to be drenched. <laughs> so yeah, literally. Um, again, I'm down some side street that I don't really... Where am I, realistically? It looks nice, restaurants and stuff. But I actually don't have a clue where I'm going, what I'm doing. But yeah. This is like genuinely though, if you want like a city break in uh, Europe, say you live in England, it's like an hour and a half on a flight to Belgium. Obviously I didn't fly here, I flew to Paris and then got a bus. However, 
it's close. But I suppose you could say that about Paris. Um, Germany's not that far, obviously. The Netherlands as well. In fact, yes, this is ideal. Get on the way. Shield from the rain. I think I said in the last video that it's hard to get lost here and now I've come out today and <laughs> I've, I've just been exploring like the back streets and stuff so you do kind of get lost and then you just find yourself again because you end up where you were like at the moment I don't actually know what's out here however I, I think I'm pretty sure that I recognise it once I get out Yeah, I do. Yeah, so to conclude, it is, it is hard to get lost in Brussels. I know I keep changing my mind and saying different things, however. I'm glad I got a, a waffle, like a Belgian waffle. I feel like that's kind of taking part in the or uh, experiencing the culture which is a good thing because I feel like a lot of the time I just get a McDonald's or KFC or something and I can get that anywhere in the world I never got an electric scooter either which I maybe should have done, but. There's loads of them, people just park them up, look. Literally just park it there. Let's go down here. I wonder what's down here. Let's see. Like the grandma. I'm really excited to do videos in like places like Colombia and stuff. I don't know why, I just feel like the kind of videos I watch of these kind of travel videos are like in them kind of places. So I'm going to do Mexico, Guatemala, um, El Salvador, Honduras, like the Central America, into South America, Colombia, Ecuador. So if you like this kind of videos and you'd be interested in that, then make sure to keep watching my videos and subscribe. I feel like I'm endlessly saying that. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. But, I don't know, it's up to you. Waffles, more waffles. 
very popular in Belgium. So, I am approaching the bus station now and we are going to Amsterdam. So I'm going to film the coach journey it's pretty much until we leave Belgium probably and then I'll be doing some vlogs in Amsterdam. Should be good. So I am on board the coach and then it's three hours um, all the way to Amsterdam. So yeah, I don't think we're going to stop. It's literally straight there. And like that, I'm in Amsterdam, or not quite Amsterdam, but the bus station where I've just been dropped off. So yeah, there will be a lot of videos coming out. So stay tuned. I am gonna go spend some time in Amsterdam and document it through the channel. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, turn on the bell for notifications, and I'll see you guys in the next video in a bit.